restoration by the aircraft's finder, Peter Monk, known as Mr. Spitfire himself because of the wonderful restoration jobs he does at the, at, uh, the Biggin Hill Heritage Hangar. So yes, if you look closely, you will see Soviet red stars on this Spitfire. It's, it's no it's also been christened Stalin's Spitfire. It was one that was led... She is also a, a local lass, having been produced at the Bickers Armstrong factory at Castle Bromwich. That was on the 4th of August 1944 when she left that and she was shipped via Murmansk to the 2nd Squadron of the 767th Regiment of the 122nd Division, I hope you're taking notes because questions will be asked, of the Russian Air Force, which was a Spitfire squadron. Unfortunately, she crashed, crashed during a dogfight in spring 1945 with just 29 hours on the airframe. you giving us a nice top side view there. thankfully being successful in purchasing her. The aircraft then returned to the UK by a circuitous route and she was then acquired by Angie Sokar, who very sadly passed away within the last couple of weeks. Uh, she was famous for her So what came to the UK was a complete, although crashed, aircraft with uh, a fuselage, large sections of the wings. Peter also flies uh, the only Mark 11 Spitfire photo reconnaissance version that's uh, in the UK and also the P-51 The finished articles often have uh, variable numbers of original parts but it's good but Peter is a stickler for originality. Luckily, has the the passion and the funds to ensure that the aircraft are restored to as original a condition as possible. 